Hey, what's up guys? I right, so I'm coming at you guys with another unboxing today. And um, <clears throat> before I start, uh, you might, you may, you may or may not be wondering why I haven't made a video in a while. And the, and that reason is simply school. It's kind of rough right now, I'm taking a lot of credits, so it's keeping me busy. But um, I hope to make a couple more videos in the next couple weeks. So look out for those. Um, it won't be anything not. There won't be a lot of videos being made, but there will be a couple until at least until the summer. But um, so today I got this Alpine CDE 123 head unit for my car, and if you watch my last video, it was actually a Pioneer head unit that I, unbo I unboxed. Well, I got a new car since then, so um, obviously I got a new head unit. Um, this this actually took me a really long time to find. Because uh, I usually buy my stuff from Crutchfield, but Crutchfield had this out of stock for like the last like month and a half, so I've been waiting until uh, I actually found uh, this small company in Washington. I, I'm not really sure if it's a small company or not, but it's called called Car Toys that has actually had this receiver in stock, and they actually included the parts, like some of the installation parts for my car, like the antenna adapter and the wiring harness. The head unit I had to buy separate, but it's pretty cheap, so no big deal. I wish I got off Amazon, but um, so I'm thankful I got, I was able to get this because this, this is the one I've been wanting. And um, so here's the front of it. Here's what it looks like. It has the thumbs up and thumbs down button for Pandora control, which won't really be useful to me since I don't have an iPhone and it only works with iPhones. But on the bottom, you can see. Pandora made for iPod, iPhone, Sirius XM ready, Bluetooth ready, cable for iPod included, USB cable included. That's why that's one of the reasons why I chose this one over all the all other receivers because this does have a cable for iPod already included and it has a rear USB which I really wanted so I could like hide away my cables. So I'll just knock the camera over. So uh just want to go ahead and open this. Well, here's a couple of the features, I guess, which you can read yourself. Not, not really too concerning, but go ahead and open this up and see if I can zoom out first. So you open it up. Got nice head unit case, hard case for the head unit itself. Kind of dusty for some weird reason push so next case put that to the side here's the wiring harness itself for the head unit uh, removal tools and s screws not really sure what these are for and here's the iPod cable itself again this is really awesome that it came with it Here's the manual and registration. Owner's manual registration. Stuff that we don't need. Well, I'll need it in a little bit, but you won't need it. Stop. Oh, here's a USB cable extension. So it has the mail. You see it? So that's cool too. That's cool too. Side. Here's the actual receiver itself, packed nicely in this wrap. Make sure it's able to be transported safely, which is always cool. If I can get this open, there we go. Oh, slide it out, I guess. Put that to the side. Here's the back of it, as you can see. So this is for the uh, antenna, antenna adapter. This is where the antenna will go for your radio. Here's the rear USB I was talking about. This is uh, for 
3.5 millimeter auxiliary. So, and here is um, Alpine's uh, like pr proprietary plug-in for like a CD changer, or this is if you if you choose to get Bluetooth later on, this is where it plugs in. So on the front, let's see if I can remove this. Here's the actual receiver itself. This also has a front USB, which is cool too. Auxiliary and so it's pretty cool. Let me see if I can remove this. So this does it is removable. Faceplate. Put that down. So here's the faceplate itself. Really shiny. I like this a lot. So I'm really looking forward to putting this in my car. So I'm gonna end it there. And uh, thanks for watching guys, and be on the lookout for future videos, and I'll catch you guys later.